Hi, good morning, good afternoon, good, good evening to all my viewers all over the world. So ngayon po ay samahan nyo po magbumukbang po tayo ng chicken fried adobo. Okay, bago po yan ay uh, magchichika minute muna po tayo. Tungkol sa phenomenon na, na, na nangyari kamakailan lamang ang pagkakaroon natin ng super pink moon. Okay, so umpisahan na po natin. Rare super rare super pink moon will file will fill skies next week how to spot it. Stargazers will be treated to the sight of pink moon next week. It will be a particular special phenomenon because it will also be a super moon making it bigger and brighter than usual. The term pink moon refers to the full moon that occurs every April and is named after the pink spring flower that appears at the same time. The name is slightly deceiving because of the moon won't actually look the name is slightly deceiving because the moon won't actually look pink but is slightly pale orange. Stargazers should be able to spot the orange pink moon in the early hours of the morning on April 8th. People in the UK, Europe, and North America should be able to see the phenomenon. The, fr the phrase pink moon actually came out due to a spring flower called wild, wild ground flag, which is very pink and appears in the US at the same time as April's full moon. This natural phenomenon is always linked to the date of Easter because it is appears after the spring equinox. You may think the term pink moon is confusing, but the very the same celestial phenomenon can also be referred as the egg moon. Full sprouting grass moon, growing moon or the full fish moon. The pink moon will look orange as it rises because when a large full moon is seen low in the sky, it is being viewed through a greater thickness of the earth's atmosphere. Earth's oxygen and nitrogen-rich atmosphere filters out the bluer wavelength of white moonlight when the moon is close to the horizon at its rises. This filtering process, known as a light retraction, results in more of the red component of moonlight traveling directly into your eye. Therefore, the moon will appear red or orange to you. The moon can only really appear to have turned pink during a total lunar eclipse, which is often referred to as a blood moon. What is super moon? Full moons occur, full moons occur when the moon is on the opposite side of Earth to the sun. This results in the lunar surface being fully illuminated. A super moon happens when a full moon reaches the perigee which is the point in the orbit of the moon when it's closest to the earth. The opposite of the perigee is the apogee, and when, and when the moon reaches this point, it will look much smaller than usual. During a, during a supermoon, our closest neighbor appears after 14% bigger than 30% brighter than usual. The different types of supermoon. Here are here are some of the most interesting moon faces and when to see them. A blue moon refers to, a blue moon refers to the occasion when a full moon appears for the second time in the same month. This is very rare and the next blue moon should occur on Halloween in 2020. The harvest moon appears around the time of the autumnal equinox when farmers tend to do their main crop harvesting. A supermoon appears when it is at its closest point to Earth and therefore at its brightest. The next one will appear in September. A blood moon occurs during a total lunar eclipse. The next one should happen in May 2020. Each month of the year actually has its own special full moon phenomenon. They are as follows. January, wolf moon. Fe February is no moon. March, warm moon. April, pink moon. May, flower moon. June, strawberry moon. July, back moon. August, sturgeon moon. September, full corn moon. 
October, Hunter's Moon. November, Beaver Moon. December, Cold Moon. In other news, the NASA in other news, the NASA has revealed a stunning close-up of Orion. The astronaut could, could build the astronaut could build moon base based using their own PPE and lunar dirt to make space concrete. And the Hubble Space Tele Telescope has revealed new, new data about what may be the most powerful cosmic storm in the universe. Will you be looking out of the super pink moon? Let us know in the comments. Okay? So, ayan po ang chika minute natin. Ngayon po ay magmumukbang po tayo ng adobo. Tara po, kain po tayo. Kain po tayo, guys. So we have a chicken, adobo, okay, our ingredient, uh, we have a garlic, onion, so the garlic and onion uh, I sauteed in a olive oil, olive oil, and then I seasoned with the soy sauce and vinegar. with ground bell pepper ground bell pepper so kain po tayo Shout out, uh, shout out kay Ma'am Shi Babes at sa kanyang anak na si Aya na uh, nanonood sa akin channel. Congrats again, Ma'am Shi Babes. At sa friend ko si Adelma Domes na kamakailan, kamakailan lamang ay uh, na-monetize na ang kanyang YouTube uh, channel. So, kain po tayo. So kung nakikita nyo natuyo po yung adobo ko kasi habang niluluto ko to ay hinahanda ko yung pagblablag ko ngayon. So konti lang nilagay kong tubig. Natuyo siya. Ang nangyari para naging fried chicken siya. So napakalasa naman yan. Hindi na kailangan sa bawah. Halika po, samahan nyo ako.
Sa lahat po nang uh, mapapadaan sa aking channel, uh, please don't forget to subscribe and like all my videos. So kahit na tuyot ng sabaw ng adobo ko ay talagang malasa siya dahil nanuot sa chicken ang kanyang sos Actually ganito ang gustong gustong klase ko ng adobo yung yung ano ko, napaka ano sticky nung sabaw malapot pero ang nangyari nga nito na napasobra na tuyo talaga So ayan po tapos na po tayo sa ating mukbang Maraming maraming salamat po sa panunod nyo at bye bye. So at abayan nyo po ang aking susunod na video. Bye bye!